recently decided to put a barbell to the test as a self-defense tool. And let me tell you, the results were not pretty. I mean, sure, it hurt like crazy, but practical, mm, not so much. Is there anything we do on this channel that's practical? Yeah, yeah. Such as? Sock full of quarters, okay? Very practical. Oh, yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you didn't think I would have one. <laughs> no, uh -huh. I did not, actually. Uh -huh. Okay, you put some thought into this. Spike flail. No, that's not practical. Well, how often are you carrying a spike flail on you? At the medieval renaissance fair. Okay, you got me again. Uh -huh. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> Damn. So I started thinking outside the box and realized there are other gym items that can be used for self-defense, such as weighted plates. But here's the real question, folks. Just how much damage can a weighted plate inflict? And is it really a better option than a barbell? Well, let's find out. I wasn't expecting you to throw that at me. What's your point? You, you need to be ready at all times. But I wasn't. <laughs> and whose fault is that? Apparently mine. Yes, I'm glad you realized that. Now reflect and get better. Okay. Before we start throwing and dropping plates on me, I first want to see what a plate can do to something that isn't me which is this watermelon. We're gonna do a peak potential test. So we're gonna drop this 45 pound plate onto this watermelon and observe the results. What could go wrong? Absolutely nothing, we're professionals. We do this every week. Which makes us professionals. Or people who just do this every week. No, we get paid to do it, so. Stuff you do every week turns you into a professional, right? Yes. I'm a professional pooper. <laughs> Holy that wasn't high up either. That could be your head. Uh, I think my head's a little bit harder than a watermelon. Don't know until you try. Well, I'm not going to try. Safety first. That's right. But you know what I noticed there, Mark? You used the edge of the plate. Mm -hmm. What happens if the plate hits the watermelon with the flat end? It'll be just as cool. Exactly. So Maybe let's, cooler. Let's try it. All right. Ooh. No, nope, wasn't as cool. But it wasn't it's, nearly as cool. I'm glad it squirted up this way. Yeah, that could have been at you. Yeah, that would have been too juicy. See right. what Artie thinks about that. It's my watermelon. Artie can. That's kind of rude, right? right? <laughs> There's plenty of melon for everyone. Well, Artie seems confused by the results, but I think we learned a lot there. Clearly the edge is more damaging than the flat edge. Although I think we could have deduced that just without the test. Mm -hmm. Deduce. Is it because of the deduce part? Is that, is that what made you? Yeah. A child, a literal child. Or meaning water. Don't no. stop. Do you ever feel <laughs> like a plastic <laughs> bag floating <laughs> through the with, air? I'm working with children. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I see a floating bag. Yeah. I get really distracted. Floating bags for you and poop jokes for this guy. <laughs> They're not sh <laughs> <laughs> One more quick test before I start getting hit. What happens if you throw a lighter plate? We don't got a watermelon this time. This is a cantaloupe thing. It's different than a cantaloupe. Yeah. I just don't remember how. <laughs> what else would it be? <laughs> it had a different name when I bought it at the store. I just don't remember what. No cantaloupe. <laughs> no. Ah. No. Okay. Wow, that actually worked. It did. <sighs> no. Oh, that looks like pumpkin. Yeah. What is? It ew. tastes like cantaloupe. I think it's cantaloupe. Why is that so stringy? It's a cantaloupe squash. Oh, it smells healthy. Ooh, let's see. Well, those tests are really effective. So here's the plan. I'm gonna get a hit with every weight commonly found at a gym. Starting with a 2.5, then a 5, then a 10, 25. Oh my God. <laughs> 35. <laughs> and last but not least, a 45. So yeah. That's the order we're gonna go in. We'll do different throws and drops to get a wide range of plate-based attacks. Couldn't do the other way? No. Because that's the order we're doing it in. And now you messed them up. 
Let's do it again. <laughs> Starting with the 2.5, we're gonna do throws and drops to various parts of my legs with this and observe what happens. This is what I want you to do, Mark. I want you to throw that 2.5, 50% power into the side of my leg. Oh, you got it, boss. Maybe use the Frisbee technique. You know what? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm right by you. <laughs> For some reason, I still don't trust you. I don't know what that is. Oh. Damn it all. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got back up. Hold on. God. <laughs> was it a bad throw? It was a bad throw. It was a little baby toss. I'm trying to adjust to this third eye. It's really hard. Yeah, it probably throws your, you know, Everything's Dead higher. Dead perception off, yeah. 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 Okay. Everything's higher. <laughs> <laughs> got, the, got the hammy a little. Yeah, it's like, ah, something hit me. But that's about it. It's like, you know. Straight to 100? Yeah, just go to 100. I think we got to. Oh, cheese and crackers. Dang. Yeah, I felt that one almost pretty much in my bone. Yeah, it's good data. Did it hit like? Hit right there in the hand. Did it go like that? Yeah. Oh, what if you throw it flat though? I never thought of that. That was much worse. Oh no. There is. What? There's there is what? I just felt like a lot more power behind oh. that, that way of throwing. Yeah. It was like. Like this versus this. Stinging and blunt at the same time. Direct hit. Solid contact, Mark. Under the pipe? No. What happens if that 2.5 hits my shin? Ooh. You're such a gentleman, giving the audience what they want to see. I know. Although I think actually a lot of people would prefer not to see this. Just skip over it if you think it's cringy. Don't say that, Mark. Don't skip over it. Watch time. Oh, uh, watch it twice. Better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my God. Oh my God, that was, just sounds so bad. <sighs> Metal on bone noise is just like, a, I don't ever want to hear this noise again unless it. it's hitting Houston. I want it as my cell phone ringer. Ding! <laughs> Instant Ooh. data there. Oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> so that'll be the only one of that we do now. Here's the last thing we're gonna do with the 2.5. Purely hypothetical, you threw one 2.5 at someone's shin and they fall over. But, you know, you think they're gonna get back up. So before they do that, you drop another 2.5 on their other shin. Oh my God. <laughs> really the icing on the cake. Uh huh, and finish them off, you know? And then you, then you can get out of there. And the five course meal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I only ask that you avoid this scab you made from the other video we did. So hit the scab. Avoid the scab. Hit the scab. Avoid the scab. So we're dropping this 2.5 about where you would have your bench press set up and it's gonna fall right onto my shin. And when it does, I won't react, make any noise, do anything. And then everyone has to like the video. Oh man, ow. Oh, sorry. That hurts <laughs> a lot. Just squeeze it harder, Mark. No, stop, please. <laughs> I have family. Cemented in iron. How was it? He can't say or do anything. He is immobile. He's like a monk, essentially. You can say or do anything to him right now and he won't react. All right. Ah! <laughs> you what, Get him, Marty! What'd you call me? <laughs> Respectable man. Yeah, that's, very what smart. Like, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> Damn it, you guys had that. I, I saw you guys fiddling with something. <laughs> Like earlier, I was inside. I was like, what are they, they're fixing something like, in there? Where do I put this? <laughs> Jeez. That hurt, but it wasn't as bad as the throw. As you can see, the difference. Oh my God. Yeah, that's uh, that's, that's bad. Which one over here? Uh, he put me pretty much on the scab. Oh, where is uh, that? I hit you right there. Oh yeah, right above the scab. Yeah, so throwing it is better against the shins than dropping it onto someone's shins. How tall do you think we could get? That was about it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, it's time to move on to five pounds. We're first going to start with a frisbee toss onto my leg. I am thinking 75% power mark. I can go within that range. Oh, that was a weird noise. That was a very weird noise I made there. I heard a little 
I heard a, a little tiny tonk. Tonk, right? It usually happens with bone and metal, like your shank. Yeah, yeah, I know. You hit my femur for sure. Uh, oh. Any femur jokes, Mark? Have you heard about the femur that didn't make it to the bar? No. Me either, man. Femur, barely know her. <laughs> <laughs> He's a dental hygienist. Ask him tooth humor. Uh, yeah, yeah. Molar. Yeah. yeah give Molar, us a... I barely know her. <laughs> well, um, that definitely hurt worse than the 2.5 at full power. Frisbee toss. But what happens if you throw the five more flat? Let's find out. Oh, that was a good slap. I kind of deflected the blow with my body movement as a natural uh, instinct. Ow, you saw. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad that hurt you, okay? Because that was rude. And now you're messing up with the data, okay? Because now what? what is this? What is this? You always gotta have variables. No. <laughs> that is me. <laughs> this test is removing all variables and just seeing what plates do. So far, I've been slapped and I've been shocked by a cattle prod. Okay. Just wait until what's next. Me twisting your nipples off. Which one? Both. I have three. Oh. <laughs> Mark, I think we can increase the power on the slap with the five pound plate a little bit. Oh, God. Just every time. It just right on my bone. You yeah. just. Gotta get a bigger side muscle. You gotta work on those side workouts. How would I do that? Standing sideways. That's all I got. Standing <laughs> sideways. Mark's going to throw a 10 pound plate into my leg. We're getting up there into some heavier weights. Should I hit the front of your leg? That's a high risk. What, what do you mean? There's more muscle there. Your first throw went way off course. And when it goes way off course from the front of my leg, there's only one other spot it can yeah, hit. But the heavier the object, the less likely it is to go off course. That is one of Newton's laws. <laughs> that, that is not Newton's law. You know what? I'm gonna do it. But I swear to God, Mark, you better hit me right here. I will. I'm getting the riot shield. This Just give it a good throw, I guess. <laughs> okay. Oof. Oof. I kind of folded there. Was that just a, you know, just a, a throw? It was, I gave it my best. Yeah, that's a, getting to the weight where it's getting a bit difficult to throw. Yeah. You know, yeah. like, especially accurately mm -hmm. as a Frisbee. Let's do something similar power level wise with just a flat slap. All right. He says confidently as if nothing could go wrong. Knowing in his mind, Everything could go wrong. You should do narratives over your video <laughs> like that. Yeah. You hit mostly the shield. The what? You hit the shield mostly. I told you to put it higher. Yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> if that wasn't there, you would have hit me in my cup. I thought you were going to say something else with a C. Why would I say that? Cantaloupe? Oh. What? You <laughs> hit me in my cantaloupe. <laughs> you gave him these glasses. <laughs> He's acting weird today. They got some weird, weird vibe with them. He's got some weird vibe going on. I will say, I think outside of the 2.5, the Frisbee hits have been worse. 2.5 with that flat hit, I think mm -hmm. it just could generate more power since it was lighter. Yeah. So I think that flat hit hurt worse there, but like, look at that, that was from the 10. Blood blister. That's definitely one of the few unbroken blood vessels that are now broken. That's a question. The, do, do your blood vessels uh, like heal and return to normal or after you just break them all, it is done? Cause I swear to God, I've broken every single one of my legs. That's why you don't feel pain in there anymore. All the nerves too are Oh dead. no, I felt that. Oh, you did? I, I did uh, feel it, yeah. I thought, uh, I thought that was acting. Mm -mm, mm -mm. But I will say this, if I would have hurt worse like eight years ago, I think my legs are kind of starting to go numb. So eight years in, it gets a little easier? Yeah, yeah, no, it's just another day in the office, you know? I know. All right, moving on to the 25 pound plate. We're gonna start 
with a blunt attack on this one. I'm thinking kind of a swing attack inward. I don't know what's gonna happen, but let's find out. <laughs> Was it even that hard? Yeah, I wanted you to hit me more on the side of the way. Oh, I thought you said. <laughs> Can you keep doing that voice? No, because I've recovered. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're going to hit me right here this time. And we go a bit more momentum. You got it, dude. Getting hit in the IT band, which is a bundle of muscle fibers and stuff, feels terrible, but I have found it to be a safer place to be hit due to less veins and whatnot. Uh, however, it hurts worse. So I was like, the worst Charlie horse ever. Yeah, oh, I, I thought you were gonna shed a tear. Uh, yeah, it, it hurt. It hurt. And. <laughs> <laughs> Frank's not happy about it, I don't think. I think he's upset. It's my leg. <laughs> Don't break his foot. Moving on to the 35 pound plate. Mark is a little bit tired because he's been slacking at the gym. What? So Jake will be taking a swing. And we're just gonna let momentum do the work on this one. Just swing it in, let the weight carry through. Let's see what happens. So I know how. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have my glasses on, sorry. <laughs> Here you go, my bad. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> nah, I still got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> That is something. Well, since we're here, I just, I don't know why you just hit an idea into my brain. As soon as you hit me, I thought of this. Same thing, but like this. Oh, you want me to give you the slapper? Yeah, a slap attack. I love it. I will say the speed he swung it in was a little less than the 25, but nearly comparable pain. I'm not gonna hold back. But no, 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 no. That's what I, I No, I, I, I'm happy you, you held called back. him weak. No, I didn't. You said you want me to slap you with some force. No, <laughs> I didn't. You can do a little bit more force, but not too much force. Like more than you did, but not that much more than you did. Like somewhere in the middle. Oh, you got it. <laughs> oh, that sounded weird. That wasn't nearly as bad. Really? Yeah, it sounded worse, right? <laughs> like, Sounded like a fat slap. It, well, that's what it was, like a very fat, meaty slap. It is more, is mostly steam. Let me slap you one more time. Yeah, do it one more time. <laughs> no! Oh. Was that your knee? <laughs> no. Oh, that was a slap. <laughs> okay, that felt way more blunt that time. Less stingy, more blunty. That sounded as slappy. No, it didn't. Didn't feel slappy either. This leg's gonna have a rough day tomorrow. What's tomorrow's gym day? It's pool, and then after that it's legs, yeah. Okay, you, so got, you got a day. Yeah, one day. You just skip leg day like me. You don't skip legs. <laughs> you see, Mark? That's why you don't skip leg days, okay? But so my your knees. legs are weak and feeble. My knees. Oh yeah, that's what they all say, their knees. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> knees. <laughs> <laughs> well, on to the drop test. I say we start at a foot high. And if that's not too bad, foot and a half. That's, that's the, not bad. Two. Two, two and a half. Two and a half. Three. Three and a half. Four. Four and a half. Five, we're doing five. What? No, okay, hold on. <laughs> One foot drop test, 35 pound plate. Any last words before we do the stupidest thing? Cowabunga. <clears throat> Looks like you could go higher. Six inches higher. How many that... is that? <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, six inches is a lot. You hear that? Yeah. <laughs> Don't no. be sleeping on six, six inches. inches. Okay, it gets the job. No, we got it. That six inches made a world of difference. You always do. <laughs> Ask your mom. <laughs> Houston, look what I got here. 24. 
Six more inches, huh? It's two foot long. <laughs> Don't tempt me with a good time. <laughs> <laughs> Twice the fun. <laughs> Twice. Six more inches. Bring it on in. We're not going to do that high with the 45. When are we going to do 100 pound dumbbells? Never. 200 pound dumbbells. That's a thing? Yeah. Do you have any 200 pound dumbbells? Mm, in my this shit bricks. Yeah, big shit. Use some big shots. You know what comes after 24? 25. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, so we gotta do it. Shut up, we're not doing it. <laughs> Last, but certainly not least, 45 pound plate. Now, this is the same weight as the barbell, but the shape is different. I'm thinking it's gonna be worse. To prove that, I'm going to bash Mark in the skull. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't have enough momentum, so I couldn't get it up to his head. But, effective self-defense tool. You scared away your... Cat. Yeah, you know, that is effective, you know. Even if you can't actually use this well, the th thought of you getting hit with it, I think is scary enough. Get knocked out. There's a scene where Dwayne The Rock Johnson throws this like a frisbee at someone's head. <laughs> Oh yeah. Just that hypothetically. Hypothetically, in the prison yard. <clears throat> oh yeah. Yeah, if he was three feet in front of me, and then he would also be like, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I think anyone that has any amount of reflexes could miss a hit, you know, dodge one. Good thing you're slow. But the test, you know what? <laughs> oh, go yeah. on, sorry. <laughs> no, that was kind of mean. Okay. Oh, I'm glad you could catch on to his thing. You're Check not you that it. slow. It took you, it did take you like two seconds. <laughs> I was gonna say something. <laughs> just, just hit me. <laughs> I think we are. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna murder you and bury you in my yard. Uh, <sighs> I think we've done enough testing today. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm done. Mark, you knocked it out of him. I tried, to, I tried to bring him back to life. He never quits. <laughs> I'm going to say to stay a safe distance. <laughs> Just uh Now he's a zombie. The only thing I got going for me is running. <laughs> yeah, he did take his legs down. <laughs> <laughs> and they're building strength back up. Come on, come on, give me. You're so scary. <laughs> 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 this is the segment I like to call Houston Cross. Getting back into a frame. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so done with this video. I'm so done with this video. Right in my hole. I'm not gonna lie, I was gonna do one more test with that 45 pound plate. But that last hit was so bad, I'm not going to. So I'll check back in a couple days and give you my final thoughts on plates as a self-defense tool. <laughs> it's time for the weighted plates data review. Three days after the experiment, I had bruising on both of my legs and a fairly large gash on my left shin from the various throws, drops, and swings with the weighted plates. But I'm sure you're asking, Houston, what does all this data mean? Well, I think it's safe to say that weighted plates can cause a lot of pain and damage when used as a self-defense tool. And I would go as far as saying that they make for a much better self-defense tool than a barbell. Not only did I find the plates to be more painful than a barbell, I also believe they would be easier to use and handle in a self-defense situation due to them being more compact and coming in different weights 
in sizes. But hey, those are just the thoughts from a man who gets hurt from a wide variety of objects on a regular basis. So I would love to know what you all think down in the comments. Also, be sure to check out my Patreon by clicking the link in the description to see deleted scenes from my videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see all you intelligent, muscular viewers in my next highly educational video. Huh? <sighs>